hi guys and welcome back to the channel before we do begin today's video make sure you guys are going down below and smashing that subscribe button we're trying to hit 2,000 subscribers by the end of the year and know we can do it make sure you drop a really like as well if you do enjoy the video but yeah in today's video as you can see behind you well behind me should I say it's not what you're used to seeing and if you follow me on Twitter you'll know 100% what this is and you probably might already know what it is as well this is actually Call of Duty Mobile uh, the mobile game which was released back in last year I do believe I can't actually remember the official release date for this thing but it's getting on nearly a year now I think it was around the time Modern Warfare did launch maybe just after I do believe feel free to correct me in that in the comments but yeah I have uh, just had a thought to myself while literally like two days ago about this game I played it on release I did a video on it and I used the Elgato screen link feature that you can have on your phone if, you, if you're familiar with the Elgato you might know about that but there were some huge connection issues and I never really recorded a video on this uh, and now I have one of these if you can see this I don't know if you can see this I'm a bit um, limited with the HDMI length as it's just come out of the back of my PS4 I've ruined it all the way around my desk for cable management and stuff so it's a little bit short but anyway enough of that um, <clears throat> I had a random thought this just the other day but this game would literally be the best Call of Duty if it was a console release and I still stand by that so so much as you can see just in the main menu here how cool this actually looks we've got this store we have event uh, events battle pass we have ranked play multiplayer battle royale we have zombies I do believe as well if we click features here I think we have zombies anyway I'm not 100% sure on how you know what, where everything is in this map but I do uh, map this game but I do believe there is zombies in this game as well, uh, which I'll show you in just a sec. But let's just say we hop straight into multiplayer right now. This is the multiplayer menu. We have match, we have ranked match. I've not played a game of ranked just yet. I'm only level 10. Uh, but as you can see, if I go into my loadouts, this is the loadout I'm going to be using. It's the M4. I've got a reflex sight, grip, quick draw, and extended mags. Very, very awesome gun. And I mean, this is where it comes into play why I think this would be the best game, right? Look at all these different guns, right? We've got the M4, PDW. The Rust, which is pretty much the AK-74U in my eyes. We have the DLQ-33, which is essentially the intervention. We have the Chicom from Black Ops 2, the M4 LMG, the XPR-50 from Black Ops 2. Loads of different guns with different names. We have the M16, the MSMC. We have the PDW again, AK-47, Type 25, the Striker, the HG-40 off Black Ops 3, M21 EBR from Modern Warfare 2. Arctic Point 50, which I do believe might be a Barrett 50 cal if I just click that, which yes, it probably is. We have the ASM 10, which I don't know what that is. Is that the ASM? No, it's like a S. No, that's like a KN94. Looking at that RPD, and that's pretty much. There's just so many things, and this is zombies mode, as you can see here. If I load out for zombies, I don't know how you get on zombies. Battle Royale, customization, all that kind of good stuff as well. You have so many maps, like you have all the, these game modes here, there's not a deal of game modes, I don't know if I can unlock any more. But hopping into maps, you can select which map you want to play, you can have it on random. We do have Takeoff, which I've not actually downloaded. Uh, Meltdown from Black Ops 2, Raid from Black Ops 2, Scrapyard from Modern Warfare 2, Summit from Black Ops 1, Firing Range from Black Ops 1, Crash from the original Modern Warfare, Standoff from Black Ops 2, Crossfire from the original Modern Warfare, Nuketown, Roast, and I don't even know what Tunisia is, I've never heard of that map, that might be just exclusive to this, correct me in the comments if I'm wrong on that, that. because looking at it, these are all remastered maps, some of the best maps in Call of Duty history, I love Black Ops 2, Raid's my favourite map, uh, obviously I've got a set on Nuketown right now, uh, there's like all these modes, honestly man, if this was a console game, if they ported this to console and updated all the graphics and stuff, because obviously the graphics aren't 100% brilliant, this, they are very good for a mobile game, don't get me wrong, but on console they would just be awful. Um, this would be the best game, it's just a mix and match of everything. The only downside, there's no prestige and it's the same sort of ranking system to Modern Warfare. You can get a nuke, which I think is 20 kills. If I hop into my stats, if I remember how to do that. So these are my stats on the screen right now. I've played 10 games, I've got 8 MVPs, my KD is 6.24, so very very good even though I've not played many games. I have had a nuclear and I've had it one unstoppable medal, but I don't remember getting a nuke. I know there's a nuke kill streak in this game and you can call it in, but I do not recall being able to call it in. But I do have a nuclear in the first 10 games I've played, which is very, very good. 
I'm going to play a little bit more ranked after this video and just play this a little bit more. So if you want to see more Call of Duty Mobile on the channel, I would love to do videos on it. I actually really like this game. I don't know why I didn't, didn't play it all the way up until now. I just only just re-downloaded it, hence the reason I'm level 10. I made a new account because the other one was linked to my Facebook. But yeah, so we're going to play a game of Domination, I think, on Nuketown. Hopefully we can drop a nuke. I think it's 20 kills. I watched a YouTube video, I think it's 20 kills. Um, so yeah, we'll just have to wait and see what that's all about. Maybe we can drop one, maybe we can't, we'll see. I don't have any game sound, I don't know why, but with this, I can't have any game sound. Can you see that? I can't have any game sound with this, because obviously this is the headphone port as well. There is a lightning uh, jack thing there as well, but it doesn't seem to work with my earphones. I don't know why, there should be game sound for you guys, it's not for me, so at a slight disadvantage anyway. But yeah. Hopping straight into a game right now, I've been watching a lot of uh, gameplay on this actually, I've been watching a lot of iFerg, he has like a million plus subscribers from playing COD Mobile, uh, well mobile games in general, I think he started his channel playing Clash Royale, which is pretty cool, but yeah, oh my days, I'm a little bit rusty, this is my first game on, getting a first blood there, and I, going for the controls uh, at the start of this game, the advanced mode, which is the one I'm playing on where you, when you shoot it aims automatically, that's the advanced mode. I think that's probably the easy mode, if I'm being perfectly honest. But um, my button, knowing the button layout is a little bit rusty, to be honest. I just keep pressing, I keep missing the button because I'm not used to playing like this, you know. I see a lot of people playing on iPads and bigger screens and having it laid flat, but I don't have an iPad. Well, I do have an iPad, but it's, it's smashed to smithereens. Uh, from back in the day, it probably won't even be that great. I'm playing on the 11, uh, iPhone 11 Pro as well. If you're wondering what I'm playing on, um, pretty decent. I presume it well. It does run very well on my phone. Obviously, it's not a gaming phone or anything, but it does run very, very well. And I can see why people do do mobile gaming at first. When I first like, I think Razer's got a gaming phone. I think um, what is it called? MSI is it MSI? Have a gaming phone as well. And there might be a couple bit couple more companies have gaming phones I've just thought why would you even bother to buy a gaming phone because like surely mobile gaming isn't that big and I've got a grenade here this is where I'm messing up the buttons wow um but yeah I don't know why you would have a gaming phone but now playing this I can totally understand and the community behind this game is actually huge I'm gonna call this UAV in real quick so I don't know they're spawning that uh, I, I always forget to look at the radar on this as well we're on a little bit of a streak right now I'm not sure how many kills we're on, but yeah, nobody seems to be that decent at this game. Oh my god, I'm going to die as I say that. Oh my days. I get this kill, thank you. Aim is a little bit rusty, we're on a merciless, so according to YouTube, we are 10 kills off a nuke. That's the end of the first round. The games are really short on this game, so maybe that's why it's 20 kills. Uh, hopefully we can get a nuke. Uh, I feel like I've had a couple of relentlesses already as well in this game. Uh, but never seem to have had a nuke. Uh, that would be pretty cool though if we get one first game on, literally. But I did tweet yesterday about how playing, how to play. Oh my god, more decent players, and it wasn't a dig, at, you know, the players in this game or me trying to look good. Uh, it's just simple because every single lobby seems to be like this. There's definitely no skill-based matchmaking in it because I have a six KD. Um, so there's definitely no skill-based matchmaking. Which is good, it definitely makes the game a little bit more enjoyable. And I'm gonna die from the car exploding, oh my god. Died off the nuke streak there, I don't know how close we was. I might even play one more game, see if we can get the nuke. I don't really know, maybe I'll just see how long this video is gonna pan out. As these games are obviously really, really small. I wanna change my streaks, I don't even bother using my streaks. <laughs> just cause it's a hunter killer drone and a predator missile. For one, oh we've got a nice little triple kill there, we'll take that. One, uh, I don't like using kill streaks to control, even if it is a predator missile, I just hate jumping out of the action. I don't know why. Oh my god, there's someone to my. Oh my god, triple kill as well. I don't know how I didn't die there. But we'll take it. We're on a little bit of a streak again. Oh my days. We are on a merciless, I think, right now. I don't even know. We're on a high streak, nonetheless. And there's no. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. We've got, well, we've got a merciless there, so we've got another merciless, another 10 kill streak. So we are going on some decent streaks. I'm definitely gonna try and drop a nuke in this video, though. 100%. After this game, I'll try and get a new gameplay. I'll try, at least try and get a 20 kill streak, whatever, or a nuclear if we can. But if the nuke's 20 kill streaks, that's what I'm aiming for. I know the nuke doesn't end the game. And the when I've been watching how to get a nuke in this game, because I saw I had a nuclear and I was like, I didn't get a nuke. 
Um, I don't even know when I got the nuclear, to be all honest, because I don't even see the medals popping up hardly, because it's, it's such a small screen. Um, even though, well, I have the Plus, the, the Max, the 11 Pro Max, so it's the big screen, and I still think it's a little bit small to play this on, if I'm being honest. It's not bad, to be fair, though. I just sit, tend to play this when I'm laying in bed. Uh, play Modern Warfare through the day or do whatever I'm doing through the day and then obviously we'll hop on this when we're laid in bed chilling and I love it to be fair it's super fun super duper fun I'm gonna play some ranked tonight though just to try and get a little bit more competition and just try and become better at the game that's one of the main reasons or one of the reasons I like playing people who are better than me it's a great way to actually become a better player in the game you're playing that's the end of that uh, first game there, so we got a victory, not bad at all. We got the top of the leaderboard there with a 3600 score. Gonna back out right now. We've leveled up to level 11, so we'll take that as well. And this is the leaderboard, we went 33 to 3, so not a bad game at all. As you can see, comparing to everybody else's stats, everybody else just doesn't seem to be the best of players, uh, which is a shame. We'll play that again, I think if we, oh no, just exit and search for another game. We have a lot of high ranks. 100 plus ranks in our team so maybe this game might be a little bit more difficult we'll see nonetheless we're going to try and drop a nuke anyway if we can do it we'll see we will see for sure but yeah I this game is if you haven't played it I would definitely 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 recommend playing this game 100% I think there's a guy in the top window I wasn't sure if I saw him or not Let's try and throw a nade up there I can't throw a nade to save my life oh we've got to open the top window anyway Went in the little window right at the top. So that's decent. There's a guy here to my right. Aimed all over the place. All my days. Come on, man. There we go. Went a little streak already. Four kills, I think. That might be the fifth. Yes, bloodthirsty. Gonna hop upstairs quickly. See if there's anybody chilling. Pop a reload. Pop that UAV. Oh no, don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. I was doing my UAV. That's what I mean. This, how did that kid not kill me? Come on, seriously. Like, I, I was scared at first. I was playing bots. I thought I was actually playing the multiplayer. But, it turns out I am. So, hey how? Just then, just not that great. Which is a shame at times, but good. Because I can get nukes, hopefully. I'm really hoping and banking on the nuke. To be honest. Oh, there's some people knocking around. One more. Kill him? No, please no one come up behind me or anything. We'll kill that kid. We're on a merciless. So we're halfway to the nuke right now. The end of the first round is quite far away. I thought it was closer than we thought. I thought we was closer than I thought. So they're coming down from they're, they're on C, so let's see if we can get a kill here. Teammates don't seem that great either. We're on an eleven kill streak right now. Oh this kid's knifing or something. Nice little kill there, beam that kid, even though my aim's all over the place. Kid at the front door, there's one more. We are on a ruthless right now, so we're five kills off. I need to actually pick up another weapon, I only have 11 bullets, which is a shame, I guess that's what you get for camping. Let's try and find another gun quickly, there's a guy coming at the front door. Please can I have your kill, and they're all there, they're all there. Pistol, pistol, pistol please, nice double kill with the pistol there. We're close, I might just even rock with a pistol. I've got the purifier. That's the end of the first round there actually, so that's come in clutch because I was out of ammo. We're literally a couple of kills away from this nuke. Apparently, if it's tw if it's 20 kills, you'll have to let me know if it's 20 kills. I've been told it's 20 kills. But I'm not 100% sure. We're going to call in the UAV off the bat anyway. I don't know how many kills we're on. I don't know how to view the scoreboard in the middle of the game. But I know we're close to the nuke. Super close. Let's see if we can just get a kill from the window as this guy's popping around the corner like a madman. It's that guy knifing. I can't even kill him. I don't like this. He's coming up. Don't you knife me. I was so scared he was actually going to knife me. And we are camping like absolute faggots right now. Where are they at? Losing C. We're on a relentless. So that's the 20 kill streak and I, I don't have a nuke. I don't actually have a nuke. I, I, I knew this, I knew 20 went a nuke. Uh, this guy in the video, he got 20 kill streak and he got the nuke, obviously. So that's what I'm going off. So maybe we're going to play aggressive, try and get a nuclear. We're very, very close to the nuclear. Anyway, we're on a, a brutal, so we're five kills off. Don't you knife me, boy. No way. We're knife 25 kills off the nuclear. So, that's so annoying. I just, how is he running so fast like a crazy man? 
it's just unbelievable. That's such a shame. Five kills off the nuclear. I'm quite annoyed at that. But nonetheless, very, very decent game. So, 20 kills isn't the nuke. They must have changed it because the video I watched was like eight months ago when the game first dropped. So, they must have changed it. So, I'm not entirely sure what the new one is. Oh my, oh my god. So, that is a shame. We are losing this game as well. Oh, can this kid with a knife go away? He's killed me all three times. He's moving so fast. And sliding and how is that guy's movement like that? Can you hook a controller up to this as well? I'm wondering if you can play with controller. I doubt you can. Because that would be cheating. But if you can then I would definitely love to do that. Because it would be a absolutely different game. Unfortunately we do lose this game. Which is a shame. Choked the nuke. That is just choked the nuke on both games man. Five kills off and get knifed. Such a such a shame. But yeah, this game is so much fun. Okay, you guys, we're back in the lobby now. If you want to see more Call of Duty Mobile content, then let me know. I'll probably bring some to you guys anyway, because I just love playing it so much. Very, very fun game. Definitely makes for a decent change on Modern Warfare. Uh, I've just got done recording yesterday's video by the time you watch this, which is a settings video on uh, Modern Warfare. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that. I know I've literally not put any Modern Warfare gameplay up now for like a week. So hopefully you guys don't mind that. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you do play Call of Duty Mobile and you know how many kills it is to get a nuke, let me know. Uh, it must be 30 kills. It's got to be 30 kills. I mean, I got 25 kill streak in that game, so it's got to be 30 kills. So yeah, let me know if you want to see more Call of Duty content. But yeah, apart from that, guys, thank you guys ever so much for watching. If you are new around here, make sure you do smash that subscribe button. We're trying to hit 2,000 subscribers by the end of the year. If you did like this video, make sure you do drop a like and make sure you do comment below what you thought of Call of Duty Mobile. If you still, if you play Call of Duty Mobile, you want to see more of it, all of that good stuff. Make sure you let me know in the comments below. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram and my Twitter. Links to them are in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to catch you guys in the next one. Peace.